Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be filming a get ready with me using the Bamboo Blur Tinted Moisturizer from 100% Pure. This will come out very soon and because I knew that a lot of you would have questions about it, I wanted to make sure that I featured it in a video soon. They did send me a few shades of this and I've had them for about a week and so I've been using them pretty regularly and I'm really excited about this product. It says that what it is is an ultralight formula that blends color correcting fruit pigments and bamboo silica to soften fine lines, minimize pores, and blur imperfections. After using this several days in a row, I do feel that that is true. Of course, everyone's skin is a little bit different, and I think it is definitely one that's worth trying because it does do more than just your average tinted moisturizer. If you guys are local to the San Francisco Bay Area, I am doing a meet and greet at the 100% Pure Store in Berkeley, California. It will be a Saturday, March 18th, so this Saturday from 1 to 3 p.m. I will also be doing a live stream with Susie, the founder of 100% Pure, and that will be on the 100% Pure Facebook page Thursday at 4 p.m. Pacific. So I'll make sure to put some links down below for both the meet and greet and the Facebook Live. That way, if you guys want to join, and I hope you do, and let's just get right into the get ready with me. Everything that I use today is from 100% Pure. They are cruelty free, and everything that I'm using is vegan. And one thing that I really love about them is that they clearly label what is vegan on their website, and it's on a lot of the product packaging as well. This tinted moisturizer does recommend to prime your face with a moisturizer before application if you have dry skin, so that's what I'm going to be doing today and I'm going to be using the Jasmine Green Tea Moisturizer. Now that I have my moisturizer on, I'm actually going to spray a little bit of the Rose Hydrosol as well for some extra moisture and the stuff just smells really good. Okay, and like I said, I am going to be using the brand new Bamboo Blur Tinted Moisturizer. This is not yet available. I'm not sure exactly when it will be, but for those of you that are able to attend my meet and greet with 100% Pure on March 18th, this will be a gift with purchase. And since this is new, it's about to come out, I really wanted to make sure to use it in a video for you guys. Today, I'm going to be using the shade White Peach. I'm just gonna dot that on and then blend it out using the Flat Top Kabuki from 100% Pure. That is light. So I also too wanna show on my hand just how much it blurs things out. I don't know if you guys can see that. It is really light coverage, but it just creates a very smooth, even base. All right, and then I'm going to use the Flat Top Kabuki, which is the F40 brush to blend this out. And since this is a tinted moisturizer and not a foundation, it is just very light coverage. So it's good for creating a very smooth, even base on your skin. All right, I'm gonna add a little bit more just because my cheeks are a little bit dry today and I think I'm just gonna put that on with my hands. I find that with this foundation, it blends out better using the flat top kabuki brush, but if I need a little extra coverage on areas, using my hands is really helpful. And now I'm going to be using the second skin concealer in white peach as well. And I'm going to use the 100% pure makeup sponge to blend that out. So now I'm going to set this using a little bit of the Bamboo Blur Powder. So this combination is meant to go together and they're meant to work together to really help smooth out your skin and create a very flawless airbrush finished look without being too heavy or too cakey. And I'm going to be using the powder brush from 100% Pure to apply this product. And how you want to apply this powder is actually you wanna tap it on and then you blend it in using circular motions. And this is a pretty mattifying powder as well. So especially if you're going to do the combination of these, if you have dry skin or combination dry skin like I do, I would strongly suggest hydrating with a good moisturizer first, which is what I did. And for bronzer today, I'm going to be using the Flawless Skin Foundation Powder in Golden Peach. And I'll be using the Supermodel Sculpt Brush from MOTD. And for blush and as well as eyeshadow today, I'm just going to be using the Pretty Naked palette from 100% Pure. So I'm going to go into the blush from this palette, which is the shade Pretty Naked. I think that this palette really complements the tinted moisturizer because it helps create that really smooth, natural, flawless look. Today's look is pretty much about no makeup makeup. That's also why I'm going to use this palette. I'm going to go ahead and do my brows. And today I'm going to be using the brow cream from 100% Pure in soft brown. And I'm going to be using that with the dual ended brow brush from 100% Pure. So 
So I'm going to move on to eyeshadows and I will be using the shades from the Pretty Naked palette today. So I'm going to start by applying flaxseed as a base and I'm going to be using the 100% Pure Crease E40 brush, which is a nice fluffy brush. Then I'm going to use the same brush and go in with toffee and just apply that into my crease. And now I'm going to use the shade Chestnut and apply that all over my lid. And to do that, I will be using the E30 Flat Eyeshadow Brush from 100% Pure. This is one of their new ones and I find that it applies sparkly shades very, very nicely. And then I'm gonna go back in with that crease brush with no additional product on it and just kind of blend that out a little on the edges. So I'm going to use the Luminizer from this palette as well, which is kind of a pinky tone, but it's really pretty. And it just gives skin a really, really nice natural glow. Going to use the Gemmed Luminizer in Rose Gold as well and just layer that on a little bit. So I'm going to be using the 100% Pure Maracuja Mascara in black today. And I am going to skip eyeliner because this is a no makeup makeup look. So I'm going to finish up by applying the Gemmed Lip Gloss in Rose Quartz. In addition to the meet and greet at the 100% Pure store in Berkeley on March 18th, I'm actually going to be in their headquarters on Thursday the 16th, and I will be doing a Facebook Live with Susie, the founder of 100% Pure, and they usually stream it on their Facebook page as well as Instagram Live. I believe that there will be a Facebook event for it. They usually do one for each Facebook Live, so I will share that on the Logical Harmony social channel so you guys can RSVP. And that is it for today's finished look. Again, it's kind of like a no makeup makeup look, just really focused on showing how nice the Bamboo Blur Tinted Moisturizer is and how it can really smooth out and even your skin without being cakey or having too much coverage. It just looks really natural, but also really, really smooth and really even. I do think that it's a really, really good tinted moisturizer. It has a lot of cover to it, and especially with the bamboo powder in there, it does really help to blur out your skin and really make it look soft and smooth and even. So I would highly suggest this to anyone that's looking for a tinted moisturizer that does a little bit more than just give you a little bit of coverage. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're excited to try this tinted moisturizer, please give this video a thumbs up. I will go ahead and link to the product pages down below so that way when it's available, you are able to get it. And I will include any discount codes that I have as well down below and I will see you guys soon.